I'm afraid I've got some bad news for you. Uh, nobody in the whole world wants to buy your product. In fact, that's true of any product. Even the ones sold by the million. Nobody wants products. Think about it. Why does anyone buy a drill bit? Because they lust after drill bits. Well, there might be a few perverts about, but in the main, most of us have no desire for a drill bit. We buy them because we want holes. Women do not buy sheep fat dyed red in tubes. They don't even buy lipstick. They buy sex appeal. So, people then don't want products. They want what the product will do for them. They want the benefits. So whenever writing sales copy, you should be talking benefits. Well, that's obvious, you say. No, it isn't. Few people really understand what a benefit is. I bet you can't easily name five benefits associated with your own product or service. Let's try it out. And I'd, I'd, I'd like you to write it down. It's important to write them down, not just try to think about them. Take your time, uh, because I really don't believe that you'll get it right. So there's a challenge. Stop the video and do the exercise. No cheating. Write down five benefits of your product or service. I do hope you did the exercise, uh, and I'm fairly confident uh, that you'll have written down a number of features not benefits at all. But people, remember, don't buy features, uh, they buy benefits. So what is the distinction? Features are just attributes uh, of what you're selling, a factual aspect of the product or service. Um, a, a dead giveaway is sentences that begin with things like, um, it does, it is, it has, we are, and so on. Our website technology, it is fully mobile compatible. Our images, they are copyright free. We are a local supplier. We are long established. Um, we have over 600 users. We specialize in your market sector. None of those was a benefit. Talking features is an easy trap to fall into concentrating on what we're selling or what we're proposing rather than concentrating what people really want. Fortunately, there's a quick test that we can apply. Try completing the sentence with which means. Let's give it a go. Our cooker has fan assisted heating feature, which means faster, more even cooking. The benefit. Um, we provide one-click financial reports feature, which means that you get immediate information and prepared statements for your accountant. Benefit. Some copywriters uh, use a so what test, but the principle is exactly the same. Uh, for example, let, let's suppose we're in a car showroom and the salesperson says, uh, this model has a Z111 engine. So what? Which means that you only have to have it serviced once every 18 months. Benefit. Just to complicate things, each feature can have multiple benefits. We specialize in your market sector feature, which means that you can be confident we understand your needs. Benefit one. Uh, we can bring industry best practice, benefit two. We can create a website that resonates with your prospective customers, benefit three. This is seriously important stuff. You, you really must set a half day aside, book it in your diary, to list every conceivable feature of your product or service. Uh, if you're more than a, a one-man business, get your colleagues to join you, and then brainstorm using the which means test to arrive at every conceivable benefit. Use a matrix and, and there is a blank matrix that you can use in your handout. You will be amazed how many benefits you'll find. Once purely as an exercise uh, I asked a major furniture retailer 
uh, to try it on their own in-store credit card. And they expected to come up with uh, a handful. In fact, they found hundreds of benefits. Things like, you're charged when the furniture is delivered, feature, helping your cash flow, benefit. Up to eight weeks, free credit, feature, which means you can buy now at sale prices. Fixed monthly payments, feature, you know where you stand. 12, 24, 36 month installments, easier budgeting. Optional insurance, peace of mind. It, it just went on and on. Once you've built your own matrix of features and multiple benefits, learn them. They're going to be an essential part of your sales armory. They need to become second nature, something you can pull out of the bag at a moment's notice. Now here's a bonus for you. Most copywriting courses, when discussing features and benefits, stop there. But in fact, there's a third element to add to the matrix that can greatly strengthen your proposition, and that's advantages. Advantages your product's got over the competition. Let's think of an example. Feature. There's no limit to the number of pages you can add to the website at no extra cost. Benefit. Which means that as your needs grow, your costs don't grow. Advantage. No other website service in this price range offers this valuable reassurance. Phrased this way, uh, you're going to be even more successful. I think it's time for you to book a half day in your diary.